Hi everybody and welcome to another tutorial um, on Beep Street Drumbo, the modular groove box, and also on Magellan 2. Um, so in this tutorial what I'm going to do is to show you how you can use Drumbo as a MIDI sequencer inside the AUM. And I'm going to utilize a number of instances from Magellan 2 as a synth. I'm going to also use drum as a, a synthesizer as well, and mainly for kick um, and snare drums. Um, I'm also going to use this video to uh, promote Magellan 2 uh, as well as a product. I have previously recorded a series of tutorials. You find the, the link included in the description. Uh, so please check those if you'd like to learn how to use Magellan 2. As you can see here, I have a number of instances and um, Magellan 2 is one of those synths which is rich in functionality from oscillators, filters, amplitude envelope, LFO, arpeggiator, code maker, sequencer effect, uh, artificial intelligence, you name it. It is a really, really rich synth. Now, um, if you are interested and if you are a subscriber, you can send an email to soundformore at gmail.com and I will enter you into the competition to win a copy of Magellan 2. In this video stroke tutorial, I'm not going to go through step by step on how to set up Drumbo, but uh, if you saw or if you can go back to the previous Drumbo tutorial, you will learn uh, very quickly how to use Drumbo as a MIDI sequencer now that it has the ability to be run as a MIDI processor. So we are inside AUM. So I have an instance of Drumbo here, which has seven tracks at the moment, they're all muted. Okay, each track sends out. Um, um, MIDI events and here is a representation of all the tracks with all the events and um, for each of uh, uh, the uh, track I have as an associated instrument whether it is Drumbo or Magellan 2. So the first one is Drumbo as the number seven which are the quick and snare drum and then all the rest of are Magellan 2 preset. So the second one a type of organ, the third one, a plaque sound, the fourth one, a bass, the fifth one is a string to give body to the song, and the sixth one is a type of vibraphone, a little bit louder. Okay, so let's go back to mute uh, for now, and as you can see here, they are all set up correctly and all the links are, have already been done as you can see they're all re received in the specific uh, um, channel MIDI channel uh, utilizing the filter all right okay so I'm going to perform what I have recorded now um, so as you um, actually before I go into that I'm going to show you the preset I used in Magella 2 if you want to recreate it so the first one is called the land and the keys um, then I have a an um, a -N kick for the kick drum. Then I have a, a 71 B way uh, for that plaque sound. And then I have a, a wet bass for the bass, of course. Then I have uh, the Luna Tears for the pad. And lastly, the Wurbly Bells for the Bells vibraphone type of sound. And lastly, I have the Snare. Um, preset com, which I created using the sampler preset, the compressor, and also a bit of reverb as well. So let's perform uh, the song and I hope you enjoy.
Okay, I hope you enjoy. See you next time. Bye.